in this video, we're going to go into the main program, the Super Streambox app. That's going to be our icon right here. You just click on our icon. Now, this is when you first got the box. When you first turn it on, you saw how it said preparing first run on the bottom. And then you got this start button. All you do is hit down on the remote, make sure the green is uh, highlighted, press OK just one time and just let it do its thing. And right here, this is going to download, um, you know, the latest setup that I have. Also, it will, uh, you know, it'll have all your setup, everything. And then also, which I'll cover in another video, is you'll have to run this again. Like if I, if I change stuff around or maybe there's a cool app that comes out and I add it to the box, uh, you'll run the program again, but we'll cover that in another video. But this is just for the new customer setting up the box for the first time. You just click start there. And again, just make sure you're connected to the internet before you do this. Uh, because if you open our app first before you connect to the internet and then you click start, it's going to, it's going to ding, it's going to say ding, and then you'll get an error, error message, but that's only because it has no internet connection. So it can't download and extract the app. And you see how fast this is going. This may be, you know, 30, 40 seconds at the most. Um, some people, when I've, when I've, uh, set up their box for them, this will, this will be crawling. You know, if this takes any more than 30, 40 seconds, then you really need to check your internet speed because um, that's that's the issue because this, this shouldn't take long at all. All right, when this, this screen that pops up, when it's all done, it says attempting to force stop Super Stream Box, click OK to begin. You don't need to click OK. All you have to do is, um, if you have a keyboard, you can use the, uh, go to the keyboard manual and you'll see the function button. You'll hold down function and hit enter and just reset your box. Uh, if you don't have a keyboard um, and you don't have that feature, all you need to do is just go unplug your box at this point and plug it back in and let it reset and then you'll be the app will be ready to go and we'll get into the app on the next video.